what I can only describe a very lightning talk on uh, tales of the not so successful DevOps. Uh, short session. Um, my name is Debbie Wren. I'm an agile coach with JP Morgan. And our talk today is really some of our experiences around bridging the gap between development and operations. And I'm Ashish Medirata. I'm also an agile coach in JP Morgan. So we kind of collated all our experience and whatever we've seen in the firm and trying to bring it together in this condensed form for you guys today. Hopefully, uh, you can take something from us. Yeah. So when we look at Agile and we look across the years, the message that's come across loud and clear is the promise of agility. The promise of agility, better, faster, cheaper, happier. Um, all four dimensions, which most organizations, when they're looking at improving and closing the gap between the various parts of the organization that are trying to deliver software, are all aspiring to these various elements. Yep. Uh, as we talk about the promise of agility, right, but you have to talk about, and the session is focusing on the DevOps state today, right? So what is the state of DevOps? Uh, it's a long journey, it's a long road, right? Uh, all of us are on that journey. Uh, some are far ahead, some are a little behind, and some are still even to get started, right? And we all understand that there are many challenges and we are still all figuring out our solutions. So hopefully uh, some of the things we'll talk about next uh, will help you uh, understand our perspective and maybe you can relate to them, yeah. So some of the challenges that we have seen uh, are uh, how do you, how are the teams structured today, right? From purely a structural point of view, so you'll have mostly the build team, which is your scrum team, right, or feature teams, and then you have your ops team, which are completely separate, right? They are like in two different uh, worlds. They don't look eye to eye, they don't see each other, right? They don't talk to each other. So it's the separation boundaries are today, in a sense, you really don't even know sometimes who's my ops guy who's actually deploying my code. So those are some of the ways uh, or the challenges which are there right now for us, right? The teams are not just separated by distance, but they're also separated by the fact, the way they work, right? So there is, from the build side of the world, there is, we gotta roll out these features every two weeks. We gotta we have this chunk of functionality coming every two weeks or whatever your cycle is, right? Uh, and then the ops guys are, hold on, hold on.